The hub is actually a direct replication of what's called the Certified Pathways Hub model. That model is a nationally certified, evidence-based, uh, peer-reviewed, pay-for-performance model. The hub was funded at the end of 2017, and so Mary came on board and she um, got it going. And then last January, um, I came on board as a clinical coordinator and we've just been building and we are definitely seeing an impact on the community. Well, I want to be able to service the people like me from my community because there was times that I needed the same type of help and it was nowhere to be found. So I want to be that person for them. We can go to the client or the client can come to us or if they don't feel like that, if they want to meet at the McDonald's, we'll meet at McDonald's or the library or in the car. We're very flexible. I am just starting out and I'm learning everything about the program that they need help with their bills or housing. I can help them um, fill out applications for housing. Um, we can do like diaper banks if they might need, be in need for diapers, make sure they get back and forth to their appointments, and then we follow the baby through the first year. It's getting help with a resume. That's something that I could help them with or taking them to a library so we can try to find other services. I know through Job and Family Services, they also have like computer skills. So if like a mom is struggling with something like that, that's something that I could link her with. Our individuals are pregnant women and minority pregnant women because they have not historically been getting the services or taking advantage of the services available. So my job is to tell all the good things that's available for them and to link them to those services that are out there. And that's a real exciting venture. The structure of the hub is, so we are the administrative agent. We um, oversee the contracts with our care coordination agencies. So we work with Life Care, um, Family Health and Dental Center, and then Star Community Support Network. Mercy Medical Center and now most recently Akron Children's Hospital and we oversee the community health workers that actually work with our clients on a day-to-day -day basis. I assist them with uh, finding doctors for themselves or their children, uh, making sure they have medical insurance for themselves and their children. Oh my goodness gracious, we've got future voters, future citizens, the whole city's built on the fact that we take care of these future people before they get here. So we all know that a health of an individual is not just going to a doctor's appointment, but it's also about where they're living. Do they have access to food? Uh, can they get to their appointments? Uh, mental health. The Stark County community has a wide variety of providers and services that are available, but unfortunately a lot of our citizens don't know how to navigate those systems. And so really having those individuals who are able to walk those journeys with our clients and being able to help them navigate through these systems is what this is all about.